If you're the type who likes to explore new and mysterious places, then you're in for a treat. Here are some of the most interesting and mysterious places around the world that you've never heard about that will make your heart race. Today, we're going to be visiting the top 10 most interesting places around the world that you've probably never heard about. Number 10, Gyachin Ruins, Nicaragua. Gyachin Ruins, located in Nicaragua, are an interesting place to visit. The ruins are the remains of a pre-Columbian city that was built by the Cortiga people. What makes these ruins so interesting is that they are one of the few places where you can see how a Cortiga city lived. The ruins covered an area of 6 hectares and consist of pyramids, plazas, ball courts, and temples. The most notable structure is the Pyramid of Nicaragua which is 26 meters high. The Cortica people were one of the six indigenous nations that inhabited Nicaragua before the Spanish conquest. They were a technologically advanced society and the ruins at Giachin are a testament to their intelligence and craftsmanship. Visiting the Giachin ruins is a great way to learn about Nicaragua's past and admire the achievements of its ancestors. Number nine, Easter Island statues. Easter Island is a small, isolated island in the Southeast Pacific Ocean. It's best known for its massive stone statues, which were erected centuries ago by the island's earliest inhabitants. The Easter Island statues are among the most famous sculptures in the world. They're located on a remote island that's difficult to reach, and for many years, they were thought to be nothing more than ancient relics of a lost culture. But recent research has shown that the Easter Island statues may have had an important roles in the lives of the people who built them. The statues may have been used as idols or spiritual symbols, and they may even have been connected with ceremonies that took place at important times of the year. Number eight, Hashima Island. Hashima Island, also known as Gunkanjima, is a small abandoned island located about 15 kilometers from Nagasaki port. The island was once populated by over 5,000 people due to its coal mines, but the mines closed in 1974 and the population quickly dwindled. Nowadays, the island is a popular tourist destination because of its eerie and abandoned appearance. Visitors can explore the deserted buildings and structures that remain on the island. Hashima Island's most interesting feature is its history. The other thing that makes Hashima Island so interesting is its size. At just 0.2 square kilometers, it's one of Japan's smallest islands. Number seven, Pripyat, Ukraine. Located in the north of Ukraine, Pripyat was once a thriving city that was home to over 49,000 people. What is now known as the Forbidden City was once a popular tourist destination for those looking to see the incredible Soviet architecture and experience the unique culture. Now, it's known for being one of the most radioactive places on Earth. The Chernobyl nuclear disaster occurred just a few kilometers away from Pripyat in 1986, and the city has been abandoned ever since. The radiation levels are still so high that it's illegal for anyone to set foot in the city limits. Although Pripyat is now a ghost town, it still stands as a reminder of the great power and destruction that nuclear energy can cause. Number six, Pavaglia Island. Pavaglia Island is located in the Venetian Lagoon between Venice and Lido. It is a small abandoned island that is now home to a psychiatric hospital. What makes Pavaglia so interesting is its dark history. The island has been used as a quarantine station for plague victims, a mental hospital, and a dumping ground for bodies. Rumors abound that the island is haunted and it has been featured on several ghost hunting TV shows. Despite its dark past, Pavaglia is a beautiful place to visit. The abandoned buildings are slowly being reclaimed by nature and the views of Venice from the island are spectacular. Number five, Hill of Crosses. Hill of Crosses is a hill located in Chalet, Lithuania. It is composed of thousands of crosses that have been left by pilgrims. The origin of the Hill of Crosses is shrouded in mystery. Some say that it began with a single cross erected by a grieving father to honor his dead son. Others believe that the first crosses were placed by the Crusaders as they passed through on their way to the Holy Land. What is known for certain is that the hill has been a place for pilgrimage for centuries and that it continues to attract people from all over the world today. The Hill of Crosses is not just a random pile of crosses. Each one has a story behind it. Many are marked with names and dates testifying to the faith and courage of those who left them there. There are also crosses made from metal, wood, or cloth, as well as crucifixes and statues of Jesus Christ and the Virgin Mary. 
Some pilgrims leave small tokens at the foot of the hill, such as rosaries or pictures of loved ones. Others write prayers or poems on scraps of papers and tie them to the crosses. Whatever the reason, visitors can't help but be moved by the beauty and solemnity of this unique spot. Number four, Dirinkyu Underground City. Dirinkyu Underground City is located in the Cappadocia region of Turkey. It is a large underground city carved out of rock and extending more than eight levels deep. The city was built during the Byzantine era as a place to hide from invasions. This city has all the amenities of a regular city, including stables, churches, wineries, and schools. There are even air shafts that allow fresh air to circulate throughout the city. The entrance of the city were cleverly hidden behind fake rocks so that they can be easily defended in case of an invasion. The city can house up to 20,000 people and even had a complex system of water channels to provide fresh drinking water. Today, Dirinkyu Underground City is a popular tourist destination allowing visitors the chance to explore this unique and mysterious underground city. Number three, Haiku Stairs in Hawaii. Perched atop the captivating Koalau Range on Oahu resides a secret staircase known as the Haiku Stairs. It was created in 1942 to provide access to an underground radio station and is made up of 4,000 steps and traverse nearly 3,000 feet. The spectacular views from the top are worth the eight hour trek and make for a once in a lifetime experience. These stairs were created by the military and were once open to the public, but now they are closed due to safety concerns. Despite this, some visitors still risk it all for a chance to climb the stairs and enjoy its views. The Haiku stairs have become a popular tourist attraction even in their closed state and provide a unique and unforgettable experience for those brave enough to make the climb. Number two, the Catacombs of Paris. The Catacombs of Paris are a vast network of underground tunnels and chambers that were used to bury the dead during the 18th and 19th century. The tunnels extend for more than 150 miles, making it one of the largest subterranean complexes in the world. What makes the catacombs so interesting is the eerie atmosphere and dark history. Many visitors report feeling a sense of unease while walking through the winding corridors and crypts. There are also numerous legends and myths associated with the catacombs, including stories of ghosts, vampires, and hidden treasures. The catacombs are located in central Paris and can be accessed by a short tour or by descending into them on your own. They are open every day except for Christmas Day and New Year's Day. Number one, the Sedless Archery. The Sedless Archery is a small Roman Catholic chapel located in the Czech Republic that contains the skeletons of around 40,000 people. It is one of the most interesting places you'll ever visit for two reasons, its morbid beauty and the strange history that surrounds it. The Sedless Archery is located in Kutna Hora, a small town about 60 kilometers east of Prague. It can be easily reached by train or bus from Prague. The Sedlec Ossuary was originally built in 1870 as a family tomb by the Schwarzenbergs, one of the richest families in Bohemia. When they ran out of room to bury their dead, they had the bones exhumed and artist Frentischek Rint created the ossuary we see today. He arranged the bones into intricate designs and decorations creating a macabre masterpiece. The Sedlitz Archuary is not only an interesting place to visit because of its morbid beauty, but also because of its strange history. It has been featured in numerous films and documentaries over the years because it is such a unique place. If you're looking for an unusual and unforgettable tourist destination, then the Sedlitz Archuary is the perfect place for you. These are just a few of the most interesting places you've never heard of. With so many hidden gems around the world, there are sure to be countless more that are just waiting to be discovered. So, put on your explorer's hat and go out and explore the world. Who knows what you might find. And that's a wrap for this countdown. Make sure you're subscribed and have that notify bell turned on so you don't miss any other awesome videos like this in the future. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.